What's up guys? I asked some of my closest friends to ask me some questions about myself and I'm going to answer them uh, right now. Uh, Jess asks, what's your biggest fear? Finding the right person. At, and I'm 21, so that kind of sounds weird to say at such a young age, but that's my answer. Uh, Max asked me, name the person you care the most about. Honestly, in my life, it'd definitely be family. Probably most importantly, my mom and my dad. Uh, Steve and Kathy, Casey, Kyle, Logan. Uh, I also have incredible friends, um, you know, from Texas and Virginia, the people at Virginia Tech. I, I feel very blessed about the network of friends I have and the people I hang out with. It's just great. I, I love everyone I'm around and I think the people that know me and know that maybe they influence me, they obviously know they're a big part of my life and I can't thank them enough. So everyone, thank you. Hunter asks, what's your ethnicity? My last name's Cortez. My dad's Hispanic. My mom's white. I've been to my fair share of quinceañeras, and everyone here at Virginia Tech, they call me Cortez, and everyone always asks why. That's why it's my last name. And Cody, is there any group of people you don't like? No. <laughs> Even elaborated, I was like, do you mean people that don't like sausage and pepperoni and Joey? <laughs> like, was not even a question like that. It was like, it was a weird question, and the answer to that, is there any group of people you don't like? No, I love everyone. Uh, Patrick asked me the pretzel question. The first time I started hanging out with my friends at Virginia Tech, I showed up to the party with a bag of pretzels because I, honest, honest to God, thought I was like, hey, I'm gonna, I'm gonna crave something. Let me bring a bag of pretzels. Um, I showed up to the first party at Dustin's house, and I was like, hey, uh, does anyone have like a pot or something I can like pour these pretzels in? Because I, at that point, I was like, okay, I'm not gonna keep stuff in my backpack. I'm just gonna like give it to anyone that wants it. And I got like a frying pan, like a pot you can like cook mac and cheese in. And so I poured them in there, and then I had this handle, and I was just like, uh, does anybody want pretzels? And I started like kind of tossing it around. I was like, whatever. And ever since then, I cannot show up to one of these gatherings without bringing pretzels. And um, I love it and I hate it. Um, it's a bit of pressure. I mean, like, uh, tonight I went out and it, I didn't have to bring them. No one was hating on me. But I definitely feel this obligation to bring pretzels. And uh, no, I love it. I mean, it's, it's kind of who I've become. But I mean, I know they love me without the pretzels. But I'm definitely Cortez, the pretzel guy, which... Which is great. I love it. You know, it adds character to me. Jacob asks, what's your first name? Which I think is hilarious. What's your first name, Cortez? My first name is Zach. So, uh, appreciate that. Jacob, what is your favorite sport? Soccer. What is your favorite food? Chicken fingers with french fries and honey mustard. Uh, what is your worst haircut? Um, off the top of my head, I got a buzz cut with my brother when I was really young because he did it and I walked in and did it and it was like the stupidest thing I've ever done. If you could travel anywhere in the world, where would it be? Nepal. What is your perfect day? Seeing a good friend, seeing a good date or something like that, having great food, seeing a great movie, and then cuddling till the end of time. That would be my perfect day. Are you a cat or dog person? Dog. Um, yeah, I mean, I've, I've, I have a cat, kind of, in Texas, but uh, his name's Bo. He's an asshole. What is your biggest pet peeve? I hate having things drawn on me, like Sharpie or a pen. Like, if someone, like, writes something, I couldn't do it. I hate having marks on me. It's the worst thing in the world. Do you have any nicknames? Family, friends, call me Z, just the letter. Feel free to call me Z. Where do you see yourself in five years? Um, hopefully like Seattle, North Carolina, New York, somewhere doing graphic design or California for film. That'd be really cool, but we'll see. What's your worst habit? It's a French film that's fantastic. Yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. Um, all my stuff, again, will be down below. I'll have a video for you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching, and uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow.